WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrial trading down 83, NASDAQ off 31, S&P's down 11. Gold, gold contract uh, trading down $8.80 at 2,333 an ounce. We have silver down 9 cents, $27.54 an ounce, light sweet crude. Down 51 cents, $82.85 a barrel, notes and bonds. A 10-year note down 11 ticks, trading 107.23. The 30-year down 27 ticks at 113.29 and King Dollar. King Dollar's up 189 ticks, trading 105.864, Euro 106. Yen 155, British pound at 124 to 1 US dollar. We can over and take a look at this market, folks. You get a choppy market. I expect you're gonna stay the same coming in. There's no big downdraft coming here. We take a look at the SPY, what you have inside the SPY here. We've got to a price point out here of 507.37, couldn't hold. You really got a sideways market. You're backing down sideways markets, down a buck 30. What I do want to do is this. I'm going to go right over to the yen. The reason I'm going to go over to the yen right now is this, is that the yen is trading 155. Now, this is weak in an incredible way, folks, okay? And the bottom line is that, you know, the market is waiting for intervention here, and they're going to get intervention. The real question is, is that, is it going to take a couple weeks to get intervention? You know, where is this going to come from? And you can see what I just did. I just put this up on a 50-year chart, okay? So when you put it on a 50-year chart, this brings it all the way back to 1987, just so you can get it, you wrap your head around this a bit. And the reason that I'm getting into this, meaning analyzing it, is that I expect, number one, that you are going to get intervention. And if that's what we get, what you're going to see ASAP is you're going to see the S&P continue higher and get huge strength as well as the gold market. The bottom line is that when they do intervene, it's going to cost them billions and billions. And, you know, those things work on a short-term basis but not a longer-term basis. So I'm just bringing that up as a heads up that when you wake up in the morning one of these days, we're going to see the intervention, you'll see the S&P up, and you'll see gold up probably $100 to $200. That's how this thing's going to shake out, so it's going to be pretty wild. We go to the queues, we take a look at the queues. Aftermarket today, we get metas coming out. Tomorrow is going to be a big day. Bottom line, this market wants higher price. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.